Day by Day, presented by First Community Credit Union. Life is better with community. Hey there. We're here to invite you to join First Community Credit Union. FCCU is the proud partner of the University of North Dakota Athletics. FCCU is here to coach you through every financial play. No turnovers. Only buckets. When you join FCCU, you get the full UND experience. Enjoy our exclusive UND credit and debit cards. So come see why. Life is better with community at First Community Credit Union. Grew up in the, in the Twin Cities and knew about the program growing up. My dad was a, a graduate assistant here in the mid 80s, early 80s. Um, so I had a familiarity with it there and then played at Northern Illinois for Coach Kill and then was a graduate assistant for him for three seasons and then spent six years at Southern Illinois and then two seasons at Winona State where I worked with Coach Frickty um, and was real fortunate once Coach Frickty got the job here that um, they had an opening and was ready to jump all over it. I thought he was what we needed, you know, he was willing to accept the challenge of coaching, you know, younger guys and developing guys and, you know, he had a good relationship with Coach Frickty and that played a part in it and, you know, we're really pleased with the progress that our guys are making and he stays on them. We'll continue to get better and better. He's really gotten us physical. We're a really young group and a lot of that comes with inexperience and so with that, we just need to work on like pad level, being running off the ball, things like that. And Coach Olson, he does a great job of that. When he's on the field, he's yelling at us, getting us fired up, ready to go every single day. And then in the classroom, he's mentally getting us good. Every single like play, snaps, IDs, everything like that, he's sending it all up for us to just be more experienced than we've shown. Through the whole off season, I mean, we lost a lot of guys and we kind of spent a lot of time just getting closer as a group because there's a lot of new faces in there. So yeah, we really trust each other and that helps us go out and play fast, physical and confident. We've got guys that have, haven't had a lot of experience until this season and have been able to get guys experience throughout the year and, and that sort of stuff. But it was just finding the right pieces to be able to put together and, and get them out on the field to be ready to go. To be able to go against them every day and have that competitive juice and it's kind of like going up against your best friend because that's what it is. And, um, every day it's one guy's trying to out, outrun and outmatch the other one. So I really appreciate what they've done and how hard they work every single day, day in, day out. So couldn't be more complimentary of them. I would say that Coach Olson has best helped just giving us confidence. I mean, we un all of us understand the offense really well. So we just go out there and play confident, play fast, and that's helped a lot. I was hurt during the spring, and so I didn't really get that extra time to develop. And as a redshirt uh, freshman, I haven't had a lot of experience. Coach Olson's been great with that working on my hands, my footwork, just keeping me like in touch with the, all of that. On the field, he's given me extra reminders after plays, in the classroom, really making sure that me and all the other O-linemen know what we're doing. And so he's just been great with like all the small stuff, making sure that we're honing in on that. Just the work ethic of, you know, learning the offense. It's been a new offense and then, you know, a blank slate for some of these guys. They came in with a new coordinator, new offensive line coach, and they got to learn from the start and a fresh start. You know, if you're willing to accept change, it can be a really good thing. If you're gonna sit there and be worried about change, that's not a good thing. Just accept it and know it's part of being a college football player and move forward and get going at your job, the best that you can do it, that really helps. They come to work every single day from Kunsi, Caleb, Ben, Carter, Liam, uh, Seth, all those guys, they come to work every single day, they're ready to go, um, all the way down to Mark Busson, Wyatt Bell, all those types of guys that are, are new to the program, they're just feeding off the older guys, setting the example. And whether it's the coaching staff, the players, each day everybody's got a, a smile on their face, they're ready to work, they give it everything that they got every single day and that's all that you can ask for as a coach and it's fun to come to work when it's like that.
Well, we're feeling really good. We've had a lot of time now to get healthy and dial in a really good game plan. And uh, we're planning to go right out there and play as physical as we can. We want to be the most physical team every week. With the extra week to prepare, Coach Olson, he's really given us a good game plan. Him and Frickty, they've really prepared stuff for us that we feel we can just go out there, run the ball, and just do what we want to do. And we believe if we follow what uh, Coach Olson, Coach Frickty, Coach Bubba, what they've all prepared for us, that we can do what we want to do. Early in the season, I think that it's important for us to kind of find our identity within the team and try to do our best to figure out what guys we can put in which situations and really create matchups. In the second part of the season, I really feel like it's crucial to improve um, on things that you know that you can improve on in film and really just kind of find those situations and areas where you can benefit the team and grow. Limiting rushing yards are really important and running the football are important especially against an opponent like Northern Iowa because that's what they like to do and they're big and physical. So we've got to be ready to go and expect a 60-minute battle on Saturday. Yeah, we love playing here at the Alaris Center. The fans, they're so great. Every single time we're there, they are like making it loud for the defense. They're giving us the ability to communicate on offense. It's been a long week without playing and we're just excited to be out there again. Oh, we got to be the most physical team. We got to get ready to go and uh, attack them. And um, they're a physical group. They pride themselves on stopping the run. Um, so we're going to have a good test there, and they're going to give maximum effort. And we got to be ready to exceed that effort and, and come with more effort than they do. Can't feel it out. We got to go from the start and, and be ready to rock and roll. This is a team that uh, is really hungry for a win. You know, they've had a really challenging schedule, a lot of games away from home, and two FBS opponents. So we expect that they'll be ready and ready to go on Saturday.